What's up friends, Chuck here, and I'm here with a content update for the next few months for the channel. Uh, so recently I did put a poll video up of what game you would like me to play next, uh, which was out of Outlast 2, The Last of Us, and um, XCOM 2. And that was fairly even, actually. Um, it was a lot more even than I thought. Um, XCOM 2 was the least preferred, but it was still in with a fighting chance. So they were all fairly popular. Um, and Outlast 2 and The Last of Us actually tied. Um, completely even votes and everything like that. So not only was it the poll um, number that I went off, but I also went off comments and, and things and, you know, private messages that people gave me and all the rest of it. So they were, they, they were basically tied. Um, and I decided to do The Last of Us first. However, uh, if you've been watching my Prey videos, um, and I think I may have even mentioned it in my Bit Hero videos, not too sure, that there was a Windows update and it completely just messed with my PC and changed a lot of settings. Um, and it, it unfortunately has changed my PS4 recording settings and um, I need to tinker with that. And I don't know whether I'll be able to do um, Last of Us first because I'm gonna have to like, reset everything basically so we're gonna do outlast 2 first um and the outlast one was fairly short i think it was like six seven hours maybe so i'm guessing outlast 2 is also going to be around that time so they're fairly short games so we'll say under 10 hours um so if you're not interested in outlast 2 and you really wanted last of us or XCOM, um outlast 2 should be a fairly quick run through uh the last of us is a fairly you know middle range game probably 15 to 20 hours or so um, kind of like a prey, I would think, lengthwise. And then XCOM 2 is, is quite a chunky one. Uh, we will also be doing Bit Heroes throughout all of that. Um, there'll be two, two episodes of Bit Heroes at least a week. The Thursday capture rate and the Sunday item find. Um, so if you're here in the channel for, uh, for Bit Heroes, don't worry, you are covered. And then the only other thing that might crop up is, uh, well, that will crop up, I should say, is, um, Monster Hunter World PC release date was announced to be um, August 9th, I think it was. Uh, now, if you're interested in Monster Hunter World, I already have a full the full campaign, everything um, on the channel from PS4. Uh, Monster, Monster Hunter, for people that knew people and all the rest of it, is one of my favorite gaming series of all time. I absolutely love it. Um, and I've, you know, smashed many, many hours out on PS4. But uh, the majority of my um, close gaming friends are on PC. And so I'm going to be getting it on PC and playing that with them. Uh, I won't be doing the whole campaign all over again because I've already done it. So I'll just be recording like some fun hunts and, you know, multiplayer shenanigans and stuff with friends and laughing and joking and all that sort of stuff. So there'll be a few hunts thrown in around as well. So that's it for the next few months. Constant beat heroes to us a week. Uh, we'll start with Outlast 2. While I'm doing Outlast 2, I'll fix my PS4 settings so that I could do The Last of Us straight after. And then after The Last of Us is done, we will do XCOM 2. Uh, and hopefully I can get the XCOM 2 um, expansion by then, which is, it's kind of like a reimagining of the campaign with extra stuff in it. So it'd be good because I haven't done that. Um, and that will be our XCOM 2 coverage. So that should take a few months. Um, so if that all sounds good to you guys, awesome. Um, if there's something in there that you really, really don't want to see, like if you're just not interested in Monster Hunter World at all, or you're really not interested in XCOM, uh, XCOM 2 at all, or whatever, I can definitely cut them out and replace it with something else. But um, that's the plan, I believe. So that's it. Uh, also, if you are um, interested in playing Monster Hunter World on PC with me, uh, let me know and we can definitely hook that up. I'm, I, I think it's coming out on Steam. So we can, um, you know, get a Steam party going and, and all the rest of it. it should be good. All right. Well, that's it. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.